stay there. Stay there. I'll take you out in a minute. <laughs> oh, he's in a rush to go out today. So, anyway, we're back at uh, Dove Site actually for a day or so. Uh, right, uh, one thing I wanted to show, which I haven't shown for quite a while, is the gas bottles. The, you can hear the keys here. Um, yeah, so I thought I'd show you the gas bottles uh, because I know our last video. I'll just put you down over here. A minute. <sighs> So the last video uh, I did about the gas bottles it was quite popular because you know, it's safe fill gas bottles which you can refill yourself so it's not the calor and um, and we got the one at the time didn't we and we had the calor bottle next to it now since then we've got rid of the calor bottle well a long time ago actually uh, so I've never really showed you what it's like uh, with the two bottles in there so I'm going to open this up now and uh, show you what it's like Ugh. so there we go so as you can see now I got asked about this the other day about whether you could put in the bigger ones now I think at a push you could but you've got to watch this because what I mentioned back was these sort of things here pushing out um, you can see actually cool there a little bit actually but yeah you got these to strap around you see so the straps go through these things to hold them in place either side now the thing is with these bottles is quite fat <laughs> quite wide as you can tell there's not much gap between them so as you can see at this point here it's a bit thinner narrower shall we say uh, as you lift these out this the fatter part of it ends up hitting here and it pushes against this one it, it's awkward very awkward indeed you have to tilt it out as well this bit here uh, can get in the way and obviously there's the roof bit there look so as you can see trying to get these in and out it's a bit of a game you can do it with these but only just but I wouldn't like to think uh, about putting bigger ones in here um, so yeah so these are 5 kg bowls safe fill bowls and to be honest when we originally was wondering which ones to go for we thought well what's the point of having bigger you're just going to weigh your van down even more and at the end of the day it doesn't really matter 5 kg yeah, these last about a month to two months depending on how much we use them depending on how much you use the heating say things like that um, these run the obviously the heating uh, they run the fridge and uh, the cooking so if they last about that each so what we do is basically when one's run out we just know that switch it over to the other one and um, I need to tighten it up actually um, switch over to the other one and we know that when we get near to a garage that does LPG not that place that I pointed out recently of course um, just go and fill up the other one I mean, it's easy enough to do and so really when you think about it there's no real need to have bigger ones the only, the only time I say go for bigger ones are these is if you are really going out into the wilderness for months <laughs> um, in that case I'd say yeah go for the bigger ones but for general riding around like we do this is perfect don't weigh a great deal uh, these weigh less than the color ones because the color ones are metal and these ones are nice plastic I'm mean, gonna look at this I can even move it about one hand can't quite lift it up with one well I can't here because I've got it strapped down but this one's not strapped down enough I have to do that so I can lift that with one hand uh, so there you go so well worth having absolutely brilliant so to those people who don't know about these things, you can go to a garage like I went to a Morrison's garage the other day again. Uh, where was that? I'm trying to think where it was now. We went to one in Doncaster, we went to another one recently. Oh no, St Ives, that's right. Uh, Morrison's garage in St Ives. It was where the petrol pumps were and it was 55p a litre. 55p a litre. So what you do basically, I'll tell you briefly what you have to do. You, these things... You have to look on the top there look it tells you open and closed 
you attach, you, you get the uh, the hose thing from the pump, you push it on here. Now, you see these little things here sticking out either side? It's like notches inside the hose thing that you take off the gas pump. You push it over, you twist it around, you pull the thing down to, to fix it on, and then you have to go to the machine. And what you have to do, it ain't like a petrol pump where you press a handle in, you have to press a button and keep your finger on the button and it basically fills these up and the, their pumps know when you're filled and it just cuts off and uh, so I did uh, it was this one actually yeah did this one the other day filled it up I think it was I think it was 9.6 litres I think I can't remember now it's about five but anyway it worked out about just over fiver to fill one up and considering it lasts about a month to two months that's pretty good for gas isn't it so of course in the winter time we're talking you know you use a lot more for uh, the heating if you're not hooked up anywhere using the electric heating because we've got gas or electric uh, but yeah so well worth having absolutely well worth having um, obviously when you do have to change the pipe over uh, I shouldn't have showed you really but I've got the spanner it goes around this bit here and to undo these you have to obviously turn that off first then you get your spanner, you undo that, but you undo it the opposite way to what you normally would do. Uh, and then it comes off. You push it onto the other one and you tighten it up, but tighten up the opposite way to what you normally would do. And um, and when you're doing that, by the way, yeah, when you're putting these things, that hose on, it, uh, it does let a little bit out. Uh, don't be frightened about that, that's normal. And you would end up smelling of LPG for a moment. <laughs> <laughs> but nothing to be frightened of it's straightforward enough to do um, and there you go so highly recommended safe fill there is another brand I think it's it's called Gaslow or something but they're metal as far as I know so they're way more as far as I'm aware so no I'd stick with that I'd stick with that so there you go anyway so uh, for the subscriber the other day who asked me about how to if it'll fit in uh, there you go so if you can judge or not but like i say it's getting them out it's getting them out as soon as you lift that you can see actually already i'm going to meet up with the other one and you've got to lift it and you've got to tilt it to get it out so i'm going to tighten that up in a minute take tight up enough. but um but when you're filling them up at the the station you don't have to take these out you just make sure they're facing outwards like that uh, and undo this if you need to undo it before you do it and um, push it in there was one thing the other day uh, the petrol station I went to the other day uh, their pump didn't have such a long end on it to fit in the uh, between here it was it was basically very very awkward for me to get in onto those notches there very awkward because of this bit here so these do can get in the way at times but with a bit of uh, <laughs> fidgeting around I managed to still get it onto there twist it around close the thing up just and uh, managed to get the gas but there you go and it's saved us a fortune so far. I can't remember how many times we've filled them up now. Uh, say not that many times, but already we've saved a lot of money. Because, like I say, Calla, about £24 a time swapping them over. Uh, this is about £5 a time. So I'm getting my money back. These were about 150 each, something like that. But uh, we're just going to get our money back, aren't we? And then save loads of money. So, yeah, well worth it. Highly recommended. So there you go. We'll just now ask Jan, see what she thinks about them. Here she is. So I just showed them the Hello. gas bottles. <laughs> I'm doing the dinner. You did? Oh, oh for change. Uh, it'd be nice if you did it for a change. What I'm do you all, think, guys? I'm always doing the dinner. Oh, ain't you seen them pictures I've been putting on social media? It's all me, really, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, I've just been showing them the gas bottles. Oh, yeah. And I've just been saying about how much it saves you in the end. I mean, it's a bit of a layout uh, at the beginning, isn't it? Yeah, but it's all the brilliant. The brilliant, aren't they? Yeah. And uh, I think the last time lasted, what, I don't know, 
month because we used it a lot yeah, more, didn't we? Yeah, it's difficult to say exactly, isn't it? You know, but I mean, we've, we're not on hookups at the minute, so I'm using it for the fridge and the cooking. So. Oh, hold on, that's right. It didn't last so long, the last one, because we was actually at the same site and it was boiling hot, wasn't it? Yeah. And it was trying to keep the fridge, fridge cold. cold. That's right. That's yeah, why it lasted. Hear it, won't yeah, you know? well, yeah. <laughs> and I think it lasted about a month from one bottle, yeah, didn't it? Yeah. But like I say, it varies, but it's good. It's good. Because you're not on hookups, as you can see there. We don't need their hookups because we just don't. We've got the waste pipe there, but that's all we're using, isn't it? Mm -hmm. yeah. But yeah, so I say it was £24 a time for Calla, weren't it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. And they were a lot heavy, weren't they? Heavy, yeah. Well, we had one, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah. And uh, in the end, we've ended up with uh, the two now. So, yeah, well chuffed. Highly recommended. You need to clean the inside. Hey, what? You need to clean the inside there, look. <sighs> right, okay. <laughs> so now it's time to sign off. <laughs> we're clean. She keeps making out as if we're dirty all the time. We're not. <laughs> no, no, we're not. <laughs> right, okay, we're going to sign off. See you later, guys. Take care. Bye. <laughs>